back here live at the Emmys. Nominee and presenter Shailene Woodley from Big Little Lies. You just dropped a bombshell on me. You don't own a television. How long has this been going on for? I technically don't have a home anywhere, so I suppose there's no TV to put in that home. Um, but I haven't had a TV since I moved out of my parents' house at 18. Is that kind of a refreshing thing? I know you miss live from the red carpet, and that's a big deal, of course, but it, you kind of just can decompress from everything, right? Yeah, it's amazing. All my friends who watch TV, I, I always just ask them when they have time to. When do people have time to? Well, hopefully they find time to watch <laughs> this and then e-news. I'm a reader, so I always read a book instead of turning on my TV. Nice. 16 nominations for the show. Yeah. What, what is life right now? How crazy is that? It's so exciting. It means people are hungry for shows like this. It means people want to celebrate shows like this, where you have um, the opportunity to explore the emotionality behind characters instead of just sort of the plot lines and the storylines. You get to experience their inner workings, and I think that's that to me is what is so exciting about the 16 nominations. It was so fun for us as viewers to watch it, but I'm kind of curious about the behind the scenes and just being with those incredible women. What was that moment like for you? Oh, so boring. We didn't have fun. <laughs> We like never crack jokes, never there for each other. So amazing to have a group of women who really are so supportive of one another and don't care about jealousy, aren't competitive, have put ego and competition aside and really just are able to show up and be present and be as like a pillar of support. There's nothing better than that. So I take it you're on board for a season two if they want to do it because you want to hang with the girls again? Yeah, dude. I mean, of Stupid course. question. Of course. I'm taking an average of everybody. I'm asking the entire cast that question, and I'm going to take the average of it, and then we're going to submit it to someone I and make it happen. average might be 100%. I'm just, it's just a rough guess of mine. Do you ever watch scenes back and go, dang, that was, that was really good. I like that. Or are you tough on yourself? Um, I, I'm both. I, I think I'm not an actor who doesn't watch myself. I think it's, I like to watch it once, and it's kind of my report card to be like, oh, that was real bad. Or, oh, that was okay, so that I can learn and grow and figure out how I can be better. Can you tell me what's going on right here? Take a look. Um, pulled that from your Instagram. What, what yeah, are you doing there? Yeah, a little that? bit different. The yeah. juxtaposition, eh? Yeah, I see it. Um, I was working, I am working actually still, overseas in the Southern Hemisphere on a movie about a young woman who survived for 43 days stranded on a boat after sailing into a hurricane. And that was what my hair looks like every single day after work when I return home from the ocean after being on the ocean for 17 hours. That's interesting. Always good to see you, Shay. Congratulations on this. Thank you. Hopefully so you find a home. We'll see. We'll see. see.